so early September, I returned uh, covering police for the, for the Philadelphia Inquirer. I came back from maternity leave and the homicide rate was on the rise. We were watching it very, qu very closely. Um, and September 21st, it tops 300. Uh, there was a time not that long ago when it was staying under, under 300. Uh, you slowly started seeing it creep up over the past several years and the past two years topped over 400. That was the highest it had been uh, since 1990 when there were over 400 murders. Um, it reflects the violence that you see going on in the city, a uh, drug culture, a culture where weapons are very available and being used. Yeah, I own a guy. I own a couple of guns. I'm keeping it real. I own a couple. But anybody get a hand on one? You see these little <laughs> kids out here killing each other. Everybody hands got on one. Guns. That's the only thing I can say. Everybody, everybody got, got one. <laughs> Even the government. Raws, flame throwers. That's all we playing with. Throwing the flames, you know what I'm saying? I don't even talk much, I got the HK on me, dog. This y'all don't got much kick. I'm going to clamp you even if you running. I'm not playing no games with none of y'all niggas. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about? That's just fire. You know what I'm talking about? See that? It's for your family, motherfuckers. Don't come through here, man. You know what I'm talking about? You think it's a game, man. You niggas think it's a game, huh? See, man, I'm just keeping up with the trend, dog. You know what I mean? Hey, they not fighting no more. They pulling guns. Me too. Watching our bodies, that's all body. that is. The me nigga too. threat me, man. He better kill me, man, cause man. I'm coming back, baby. Me too. I'm keeping it real. Just the way of life. Now this is getting worse, cause it's over money and petty shit. Like, yeah. it's not even over nothing for real, for real. Like everybody wanna put in work, but everybody want it seen. Like then, then, then the snitch will come into play. Then everybody don't wanna go to go to jail. Then everybody wanna like you, but you wanna shoot somebody in broad daylight. But then you gonna get mad when a motherfucker tell you like the snitching shit not cool at all. God niggas out here snitching and shit, man. You always trying to do is get this money, man. But the thing is, like moving silent, like catch that one, catch that one person you wanna hit, and then hit him, like you know what I'm saying. If you gonna hit him, like you know what I mean, like that shit crazy, like it's not that shit always not cool. Like you trying to hit, I'm trying to hit you, then I hit your daughter, like. Come on, dog. Like I hit your daughter by accident. Like missing you. Like go ahead, run down. If you gonna hit somebody, run down on them. Like you know what I'm saying. And then if you is gonna run down on them, make sure you run it down on them for the right reason. Like I ain't, I ain't gonna say I agree with murder and all that, but if I mean it's cold, it's a code of life. And if you break the code of life, sometimes such things gotta happen. Like the murder rate, like they drawn. Like you know I mean, I I was brought up. You know what I mean, rumbling. Like you know what I'm saying, we get in the middle of the street, we fight it out. Like since a young boy, like you know what I mean, all this gun. You know what I mean, I got brother, sisters, mom. You know what I'm saying, let let a nigga harm my mom or my brother. You know what I mean, they gonna have to deal with me on some real shit. Like you know what I mean, or well, everybody wanna be that cold killer and that cold gangster. But all the cold killers and the cold gangsters in movies ain't none of them get caught. And if they did get caught, they went down because niggas was snitching on it because they done did some dumb shit in broad daylight. Like every day I come out, open my door. You gotta worry about, you gotta worry about the stick up kids. These shiesty cops, you know what I mean? Niggas the, smoking the, that wet. The, 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 the weed, the everything. Every, uh, what, what the fuck all, everything. Like every day, you worry about what you gotta go through and how you going through it because sometimes it look easy as you open your door, but a but car might not. come by. The son and them might run out in the middle of the street. You gotta go in front of the car to stop uh -huh. the car and get hit. And then, like you said, you got the shootings around. Bullets not made for you, but uh -huh. bullets don't got no name, so they spread it all over. Yeah. So you, you could get shot in that moment anyway, just because you want to walk by and go to the store. And, yo, it's crazy, because, like, I lost nine of my homies last year, like, yeah. nine of them. Like, I lost my OED that told me how to play ball. I lost my OED that used to coach me. And it's like, it's not just drug dealers no more. It's working people and everything. Like, it's not... It's not what it is. Like it should be code to this. Like if it is gonna be murders, like let it be a code. It's not even organized no more. Like people just putting in work in the middle of the street. Like there's little kids out here, little kids getting killed and everything. Like it's crazy. Like it don't make no sense. Like I hit my chest, my leg, and my ear. I'm still here. It's a blessing. I still gotta keep my head up. Sometimes it do make me sad. Think about him and shit. I just seen him and like two weeks later, I heard he got the call. He was in the hospital, shot nine times. Might not make it. It was cool though. Yeah, I know a lot of people that been shot and murdered. Pe my people, you know understand? Rest in peace to Mike. They got shot in Rest front in of in front of Jet Making Store. Yeah. You understand? 
Hey, it's crazy out here, man. For real, man. That's Who you know <laughs> Clay, Clay, got shot up here. Rest up to rest the beast, Clay. You know what I'm saying? You know I mean? Crazy out here. I know a lot of people that have been shot and murdered as well. Um, this past summer, I've been to a few funerals, you know, that uh, touched the neighborhood. You know, a good, a lot of good people we lost in this community. You know, senseless. Rest in peace, Clay. Rest in peace, Clay. You know, senseless murders, you know. Well, I mean, I've heard that there was uh, violence going on in the city of Philadelphia. I don't really live in this city so much. I, I'm in the suburbs, hence why I'm in the suburbs. The murder rate is high because of the youth don't have any opportunity. And they're getting a hold of the guns like soda. So what happens is, being as though they have so much time on their hands without having opportunity, they become bored, boredom sets in. They start having no money. The money is so stringent where they can't feed themselves. They don't have job opportunities. So they start branching off in these areas, in these neighborhoods where they can actually feel as though that they are a king. There's a lot of social issues that come into place. Uh, you know, the economy is not good. Uh, when you talk about jobs, jobs in the inner city, uh, the availability of jobs is not good at this time. Uh, you have more people on the street, more people on the street during the day, more guns available. So all of that is contributing uh, to the murder rate. I mean, people ain't, I mean, the government ain't giving nobody no jobs right now, so got to find a way to eat, man. It's, it's, it's fucked up, but shh. Stop it's the streets, man. Nothing, man. Just stop killing people for nothing. Half of these murders is for nothing. Just stop killing people for nothing. More jobs. More jobs. I could agree with him. So, how do we start dealing with it? Keep the violent offenders in jail. Uh, get the people who can be rehabilitated into the proper programs. Get the illegal guns off the street. Uh, you know, will tougher gun laws be beneficial in achieving that goal? Certainly a lot of people believe so. Uh, something has to be done. Nowadays, nobody respect nobody. <laughs> y'all don't understand, like, what do y'all get through y'all heads? Man, this is life, reality. This is not gonna stop. Chino pistol, I'm a gun, homie, who want what? I like beef, I like to eat, nigga, who want grub? Y'all gripping guns, hey, who gon' bust? We in the zone watching who gon' rush, and we bombing. Listen, we ride like the Taliban, AR dub. Send shots from the balcony, lays our dub. Innocent bitches got them swallowing nuts, taking dick to the neck. I got them working, baby, hop in the truck. You poppin', I got him. You copin', got an option. I got weed too that had you high like the mountains. Up above clouds, I done seen all nine of them. Man got 20, somebody dropped a dime on him. Cops watch plotted on him, hit him from an angle. Shackles from the ankles, another slave in the bing.